Wilson and his men took it to Van Horn to be put on a boat and tried for murder. I am sorry to hear that. We gotta let her go. John's, uh, well, sorry, son. Without John, she's just bait. We got a bunch of money, Dutch. She's just a girl. They won't do nothing to her. But me and the boys know. Yep. We need to keep riding on this one, Dutch. You know it. Every man here knows so we it. we just gonna let the boy be made an orphan? It, it ain't like that. What is it like? I wanna live, cowpoke. I still got the choice. Dutch, it's just a girl. You're right. Dutch, Micah. Uh, it pains me to say it, Arthur. But he's right. Dutch! Come on, boys. Yeah! Yeah! God damn years. Come on, Arthur. Let's go get her. You and me is all we need. Miss Tilly. Here. Take this. You take this money, too. Take Jack, and you wait at Copperhead Landing for Abigail and Mrs. Adler. Thank you, Arthur. You're a good girl. You live a good life now, you hear? All right, Arthur. I'll... I'll miss. Me too, sweetheart. Me too. Jack, come here. Be brave, son. I'm gonna go get your mama. Mrs. Adler! Ride with me! If they're putting her on a boat, they'll probably dock at the north end of town. So I reckon we should go in the other way. Sure, I guess. I don't know. Oh, those goddamn bastards. Look, just follow me, okay? We're gonna get this done, Arthur. Now, he don't care if he orphans his friend's child so long as he gets rich. All his goddamn talk all them years. Seems like it was always a lie. Or he went crazy. Yes. Sure. Guess he began to believe he was God or something. I don't know. I'm sorry you got dragged into this. Into us. Listen, if you hadn't shown up in my house that night, I'd be dead. And even this bullshit beats dead. I thought I could find a way to get John, Abigail, and Jack out of this mess. To give them Life. Seems I left it too late. If we could still get Abigail, maybe her and Jack will be okay. John, Hosea, Mac, Davy, Jenny, Sean, Lenny. We have to put an end to this. <coughs> an eagle flies. Another angry fool he used just like he did with the rest of us. Like I said, Arthur, we don't need them. We're gonna make this right, me and you together. What's left of it? Now come on. Ditch the horses and come up with a plan. How you feeling? I'm okay. I think you should cover me and I'll go in there and get her. Cause you're the better shot, I mean. That ain't what you mean. I can still fight. I know, Arthur. But just do it my way, honey. It's for the best. Get up someplace high, like the lighthouse or something. And cover me. Please. Okay. Get.
you bastard. Mr. Milton, I guess we're gonna have to talk this out like gentlemen.
Calm down, Mr. Morgan. That's quite a cough. Sure. Tuberculosis. I'll be dead soon. And you with me, Mr. Milton? You'll be dead, sure. But I'm gonna be just fine. We offered you a deal, Mr. Morgan. You should have taken it. I'm a fool, Mr. Milton. Not all you boys have quite so many scruples. Old Micah Bell. Micah? You mean Molly? Molly O'Shea? Sweated her a couple of times, never talked a word, had to let her go. Micah Bell. We picked him up when you boys came back from the Caribbean. And he's been a good boy ever since. Okay. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Using your strength, Mr. Morgan. You're still a yapping dog, Mr. Milton. Horrible man. <laughs> now come on, both of you. to John. Where's John? I, I don't... I Arthur. He... What? He got killed or he what? got captured. No. I'm really sorry. No! Abigail, I'm, I was on the train and I didn't see it. No! Jack, he's safe. <laughs> Mrs. Adler will take you to him. But, John, I want you to know this. He loved you. He loved you, and Jack, he did. He wasn't perfect, but he did. Now, you gotta go get that boy. Come on, get out of here. What? Arthur, what are you doing? I gotta go have a little chat before I get much sicker. No. 
Don't you, don't you owe Arthur me. Neither of you two. Not now. You both know. You're good women. Good people. Best. You go get that boy. There'll be time for sorrow later. If you're headed back there, Arthur, take this. I don't need it anymore. What's that? There's a chest in them caves, in the back to the left, hidden under a wagon. Duchess chest. All our money. I know John told you I knew where it was. <sighs> Abigail Roberts. Always was a good thief. That you was. <laughs> Go on, get out of here. yourself into the grave. Get them bags packed up quick, Miss Grimshaw. Come on, all of you. Well, we're doing our best. Hurry, we ain't got long. Hurry. We just got plenty of time, Micah. Oh. We all need to have a little chat. Blacklong, you're back. Hooray. <coughs> I just saw Agent Milton, Dutch. Abigail shot him. She's okay. Not that you care too much about that, you rats. All of you. Seems old Micah was pretty close with Milton. What the hell are you talking about, cowpoke? You talked. That's a goddamn lie. Dutch. Dutch. Think of the future. Milton told me. <laughs> and you believe him, Black Lung? You believe him? It all makes sense now. No, it damn well doesn't. 
Dutch. Think. Dutch. Be practical now. Dutch! John? You left me. You left me to die. My boy. I didn't have a choice. John, I didn't... You! I didn't have a choice. You left me! All of you, you pick your side now because this is over. All oh, them years, Dutch, for this snake. <laughs> oh, be quiet, cowpoke. Be quiet. You live in the clouds. No, you be quiet, Mr. Bell, and put down your gun. There's Pinkerton's coming fast. <laughs> now! <laughs> Who amongst you is with me? And who is betraying me? Well, I'm here. Think. Think for yourself. He's lying. He's lying. Put your guns down! God damn it! Move! You ready, John? Yeah. Everyone get down! This is Agent Ross with the Pinkerton Detective Agency. Put your guns down! Lay down your weapons now! We have you surrounded! Lay him out! Abigail's safe. So's Jack. Where are they? It was Sadie and Copperhead Land. Thank you, brother. I want you to not look back. Like I said.
go! Come on, ride! Yeah. There's Pinkertons up ahead in the trees! Drop that man! Come on, Arthur! Christ alive! Stop right there and drop your weapons! This one's fucked! Come on! Don't turn it back now! There's an army of these sons of bitches! Yep. Pinkerton's on the left! They'll keep the others busy! Down there, I'm dead in five minutes. I got a family. That's more important. Uh, maybe you're right, but <clears throat> you want the money? You head down. I gotta go to my family. <sighs> Arthur, just I'm coming with you. I'm gonna get you out of this bullshit. If it's the last goddamn thing I do. Thank you. Ah oh, shit! Let's go! We need to find higher ground! Don't worry about them. They'll just be going back for the money. We need to get the hell out of here. Shit. I'll just get up this cliff. Here. You go. Come on, Arthur. Keep pushing. They're climbing. Close! Get behind a rock! God damn it! They're everywhere! Get out! Get that asshole! I gotta move! Come on, we need to get going! Let's go! Come on! We need to get up! All right, Arthur, come on, let's go! You go. Keep pushing, Arthur. No. <coughs> no. I think I've pushed all I can. Come on. You go. We ain't got time for this. Not now. We ain't both gonna make it. Go. Now. I'll hold them off. It would mean a lot to me. Please. There ain't no more time for talk. Go. Arthur. Go to your family. Arthur! Get the hell out of here and be a goddamn man. You're my brother. I know. I know. God damn you bastards! Drop that cocksucker!
gonna reach that gun you ain't you lost my sick friend you lost Man. despite my best efforts to the country it turns out I won It's over now, Arthur. It's over. Oh, Dutch. He's right. You know it, and I know it. He's sick. He's dying. He's talking crazy. Come on, Dutch. Let's go, buddy. We made it. <laughs> we won. Come on. John made it. He's the only one. <laughs> the rest of us. No. But I tried. 
In the end, I'm dead. Come on. Let's go. We can make it. Come on, Dutch! Come on! Ugh! <sighs>